Hey family, so listen, I have something very quick to share with you all. I asked the Lord when I was spending some time with him, I asked him this morning if there was anything that he had wanted me to share for the month of October. And you know, I just posted the shift in transition. So this would be more of kind of a continuation to that, I suppose, because he did give me something that he wanted us to actually focus on for this month of October. So when I asked him that question, he just said Isaiah 60. That's all he said. And so I said, okay, I will go and tell them and we'll go and let them know. And also the other thing that he wanted me to mention on here was that he had placed it on my heart that for every month going forward from today, this will be something that he'll have me be doing. Sharing with you guys for the month what scripture to focus on prophetically as a body and for each of us and ourselves individually what god wants to speak through his his word over our lives not just from the rhema words that he releases but also from the scripture and so isaiah 60 which i'm gonna actually link it below in the description for your access so when you're finished watching this video you can definitely go click it and read or if you have your bible on hand you can just go read but one of the things that the lord really wanted me to pinpoint with this because i know that many of us know of the scripture isaiah 60 and for those of you that don't know it is such an empowering 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 scripture it shows you as a child of god and you're walking with god it shows you what the outcome is of you allowing god to journey with you in becoming the you that he has called you to be full of purpose and destiny in the earth it shows you the outcome of that and for those of you that do know the scripture it is just a reminder but one of the things that god want me to pinpoint okay is that really sit with god god is giving a lot of practical things like instruction that he wants us to do or begin doing if we have not begun doing it we have to actually be intentional about these things right god wants us to begin if you haven't been begin doing it if you have been then continue doing it and don't stop being intentional and not just reading the scripture when you're reading it the scriptures are always revelatory when you're reading them with the holy spirit allowing the holy spirit to guide you just sit with the lord and ask the lord say lord as i read the scripture i ask that your spirit guide me to whatever deeper revelation you want me to receive for myself individually within this scripture i always say a little prayer before i read scripture i always just asking the holy spirit to be with me and guide me through the scripture and if there's anything that he wants to point out that he would do so when you read isaiah 60 in this time god has a lot to say to a lot of you through this scripture and the time is crucial for you to be hearing god on what he has to say about your destiny your purpose and your future here on earth it's very important and so that's what i wanted to share with you this morning really when you're reading this scripture as with other other scriptures as well don't just read it and then close the bible up and that's it but really read it sit in it sit with it and you'll find that as you read certain things will really pull on you stick out to you and if those things stick out to you highlight it and sit with it meditate on the word and allow the holy spirit to really minister to you on why that stuck out to you you know ask lord hey lord why is this sticking out to me so much like what do you need me to know here is there something you want me to see here this is the scripture for the month of October for those of you that are subscribed for those of you that just clicked on this this is the scripture for the month of October it is a very hopeful scripture in a very dark time and um yeah so that's all I wanted to share with you guys I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next video